Okay, top of the day to you, my friends, my family, and my fellow fans here on YouTube. That's a lot of F words in one sentence to open up with, right? But it is what it is. Hey everybody, it's me, John of Tucson, this guy right here. And as you'll see, my logo now has my new kitten, Milo, incorporated into it. Again, tip of the hat to my friend Gerard in Ireland for making this entire logo for me. And uh, I used to have my cat Buddy in there. Unfortunately, I lost Buddy a few weeks ago, which broke my heart. And uh, I went out and got myself another kitten. Excuse me, let's do this. Got myself another kitten the next day after putting Buddy down, unfortunately. And uh, there he is, Milo the Magnificent in my new logo. So, hope you guys like it. And uh, I also hope you've been having a terrific time in the interim uh, since my last video. Uh, I'd like to say again thank you to everyone who's been uh, subscribing to my channel and, and leaving so many comments. Your comments are just key to this channel um, being a success for me because it allows me to communicate with other fans like you and that's important to me. Um, I feel kind of isolated here in the United States as an American fan of Filipino singers because um, you know before the internet I had no access to your music at all and uh, now that it's 2019 I've got pretty much complete access to everything over in the Philippines. However, I'm still relying on you people, my subscribers and fellow fans, to alert me in the comments if there's a video you want me to go ahead and take a look at to perhaps contemplate for a reaction video. Leave me a link in your comment and I will be more than happy to do that for you. And chances are very good I will be making a video. So, there you go. Alright, tonight like I said, we're going to be focusing on Morissette one more time, and uh, a lot more in the future. This one is uh, a really terrific one. I only ran across it myself about a week ago. I've seen it once, and it's really good. It's Morissette singing with a young gentleman, and um, I'll tell you about that when I pull up the video. Uh, it's one a lot of you have probably already seen. I think it's been around for a little over a year now, maybe a little longer than that. But again, I'm late to the game. You know, I, I get busy in my life here in uh, Tucson, Arizona, taking care of my mother, my aged mother. And so consequently, I don't have the time to find all of these wonderful videos in the Philippines and have quick access to them like you fans do that live over in the Philippines. So keep me alerted. Send me those links, guys. I love getting them from you. And again, your comments are key. All right, let's go ahead now and uh, shut my mouth and flip this on over. Let's do this. Here we go. All right, I have to put on my glasses for this because I'm blind as a bat, as you know. All right, this is... Uh, a song by written by I believe Callum Scott called You Are the Reason and uh, this is a cover done by Daryl Ong and Morissette Aman and again I'm sure a lot of you have already seen this and experienced it it's magnificent well now it's my turn so let's go ahead and do this Let me open up the screen and let's do this Just to be with you and fix 
Excellent. All right. Okay, well, uh, as you can tell, whoops. Here's the little beastie. It's nighttime and uh, he wants to play. <laughs> of course, I'm trying to make a video and he wants to run around me. <laughs> so, <laughs> at any rate, uh, like I said, I just ran across this particular video about a week ago and uh, if you're familiar with my my uh, reaction videos that I normally do I'm conducting and lip syncing and all that fun stuff well this one I'm not simply because I don't know the song you know when I said I have only listened to it once uh, I'm being quite honest about that only once and then I'm like save it save it for a reaction video first thing I noticed in this uh, number one the uh, the young gentleman that's singing um, Daryl Ong, I believe it is, has such a clean voice for a male singer. Um, he's not overpowering, um, I'm not overshadowing more set singing whatsoever. And uh, he just he holds his own so beautifully because it's an obviously it's a very intricate song with the uh, intertwining melodies uh, and harmonies and. Uh, it was interesting to watch uh, Morissette there, especially towards the ending. Uh, I guess it's about probably the last 30, 40 seconds or so of the song. She's actually, con you know, she's conducting him. You can tell they had re had rehearsed the song together several times, and she was just making sure, okay, follow what's going to happen here because it's, it's going to get a little bit intricate with the timing. And boy, he was spot on with her right along. All the way to the end and uh, their, their harmonies together were just breathtaking uh, this is going to very quickly become one of my favorite Morissette videos simply because it's her singing with somebody else in the studio and it's so rare that any of his fans get a chance to actually see videos of our favorite singers in the studio you know, singing, making that, making whatever uh, song it is that we are listening to. 
it's very rare to come across that and I'm not quite sure why um, I can speculate I assume a lot of it has to do with uh, when you're in a recording booth and uh, you're putting together a song or an album of any kind there are going to be a lot of starts and stops trials and errors they're going to be punching in punching out on certain uh, phrasing and words and uh, I would imagine that the video we just saw it looks like he was probably all done in just one take after who knows how much uh, rehearsal God, he loves to run across the keyboard right in the middle of me doing something hey you um, so sorry again just my take on you know, just a small part of uh, the recording process because it does take a lot of time, a lot of effort, and in many cases a lot of different takes to put together um, just one song, let alone an entire album, a uh, compilation of songs. I'm going to go ahead now and uh, continue to concentrate on Morris set. Um, her, her stage performances and her duets with other singers, uh, male and female, including with Regine Velasquez, because there's a, there's a medley that she sang, that Morissette sang with uh, Regine. It's a Mariah Carey medley, I believe. And again, that's when I, I only watched it once and I saved it so I wouldn't be stale when it came time to do a reaction video on that. So I may go ahead and knock that one out too uh, this evening as long as uh, I'm awake and in a great mood. Mom is sleeping. I don't have to worry about her uh, you know, wandering about the house and, and falling down because of her age. You can hear the cat running around, right? <laughs> Welcome to my world. It's uh, 129 a.m. on uh, September 20th, 2019. Where I am. All right, guys. Um, again, thank you for liking and sharing and uh, subscribing to this channel of mine, this, this small channel. It means a great deal to me. Um, I, I enjoy doing these reaction videos for you. And uh, more importantly, I really enjoy the interaction that I have with other fans across the globe, especially you Filipinos. You're some pretty terrific people. So, like, sub, share, comment, thumbs up, thumbs down, any of that. It's all good. All good, guys. And uh, come on over to uh, my Bit Shoot channel, it's just like YouTube, and I have a link to it in my description. Um, if you watch YouTube and you're a fan of YouTube, Go over to BitChute, set up your own account just like you did originally on YouTube. You only have to do it once. And you're going to find that most of the content providers that you enjoy on YouTube, they're fleeing over to BitChute because uh, YouTube is in trouble. That's all I'm saying. So get over to BitChute, set up your own account, and uh, look for people like me. You know, your content providers that you enjoy. I'm John in Tucson over there. And again, there's a link in my description of every video that'll send you on over to my uh, channel on BitChute. Same content, basically, but uh, it's peer to peer. So we'll talk about that some other time. People, you know what I'm going to say. My closing tag for the most part every time is number one, be kind to yourself, all right? It's important. And uh, number two, go out, do something kind for someone else today. Maybe you know them, maybe you don't. It doesn't matter. Just get out there and do something kind for someone else today. Don't tell anyone you did it. And uh, just kind of sit back and, and, and watch the reactions of people around you because you did something kind and you didn't say anything about it. Um, it has a ripple-on effect, or a knock-on effect, and uh, that to me is important. That's that's what I'm attempting to do in my own life when I get out there uh, in public and I'm intermingling with uh, the rest of the, of the world. Be kind. It pays back in dividends all the way around for people uh, that you don't even know, for friends and family, and it does come back to you. So go do it. I highly encourage it. Okay, guys, I'm going to wrap this up and uh, probably move on to the next video.
You guys take care, and we'll talk to you very, very soon, all right?